man, good day to stay in and shop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, exactly. Good day to shop from the comfort of your keyboard. Yes. Because yes. even though it, it wasn't that much snow out there today, mm -hmm. it was drizzly, it was cold. We started the day with some snow, and now we're finishing the day with some more snow. Not for everyone, but a little bit out there. Mm -hmm. It's going to slow things down on the roads this evening for sure. Right now we are seeing some of the steadiest snowfall we've seen yet today start to fill in in areas north and east of the city, especially portions of Lower Bucks County, Burlington County, and Ocean County right now. Seeing a pretty decent band of snow set up. You can see how intense that precipitation is. You look off the coast there and you can see the reds and yellows. It's coming down in a pretty good clip and starting to finally fill in across portions of our area. Now for most of our area, the intensity of this band is going to be too far east to bring much, if anything, in the way of accumulation. However, if you're in portions of Lower Bucks County, Upper Burlington County, Ocean County, you are seeing a pretty good slug of snow right now. Now it's lighter up across North Upper Bucks County, Naka Mixon down toward Bedminster and toward Plumstead. It's snowing, but at a pretty light clip, and it's mainly mixing with rain as you head further south along the, the Blue Route here and down toward the city of Philadelphia. We've got some rain mixing with the snow, but this area is starting to look a little interesting around the Bordentown area, Levittown down toward Bristol, snowing at a pretty decent clip. And as you head a little further east as well, you can see right along the coast here, there is some mixing happening, but Tom's River, Seaside Heights down toward LBI, it is snowing, mixing with rain, but at a pretty good rate as this system continues to intensify off the coast. As far as limiting factors are concerned, though, we do have still temperatures above the freezing mark. So anything that falls is going to have a tough time accumulating. It's 36 in Philadelphia, 34 in Trenton, 37 in Allentown and 36 in Atlantic City. Temperatures will be dropping quickly now that the sun is down. So the rest of this evening, scattered areas of snow in some spots, a mix. And it doesn't look like we're going to see much again as far as accumulation. But in some of those heavier bands, a quick coating to an inch cannot be ruled out. Later tonight, the snow showers will end before midnight for most of us. Then overnight and into tomorrow morning, we'll have areas of black ice developing on the roads because anything wet, any puddles, any lingering moisture out there will refreeze for tomorrow morning. So this evening, again, especially north and east of Philadelphia, if you're headed on 295, if you're up toward the Bordentown Bristol Bridge area, watch for major slowdowns, uh, portions of Burlington County and down the shore as well, areas of snow. We're going to go ahead and give you the red light, even though it's not terrible everywhere, and mostly the roads are just wet, but low visibility outside as well. Later tonight, some snow showers could slow you down, and then that refreeze tomorrow morning leading to icy spots. Overnight, scattered snow showers, breezy and cold. There we go, below freezing, 30 will be the overnight low. Tomorrow is mostly sunny and windy. It's a chilly day, 41 degrees. The wind will make it feel even colder than that. But we do keep it generally quiet through the eyewitness weather seven day forecast. It is going to stay chilly through the rest of the work week and into the weekend, but generally dry. Just a stray flurry on Wednesday, Thursday 43 and breezy. Friday's not terrible, but then Saturday we'll see sunny, cold conditions. The high only 40 degrees. So a cold start to December, and it's never fun when your very first system of the year turns out to be a little bit of a bust, a little bit of a tricky forecast, but at the very least, we're kind of just easing into the snow season yes. with this system. Didn't turn out to be too much of a hassle for people, which is good news. Yes. No complaint here. Nope. No. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kate. Sure. Well,